Ilagbara Oluwa Emi mi mo tu na mi da God bless you for joining me tonight. Please try and press a share button. Share with your friends. We are in a press section now. Aha. Oh, push! I do I will not do 
right. Amen. Some minutes more to enter the prayer. Begin to appreciate God. Begin to thank God for day 19. It remains seven days a week. By this time, next week Sunday, we are over. We thank God for the journey, for the strength. They are too fast. God bless you in the name of Jesus. We give God glory for his grace, for his love, for his presence over our life tonight. We thank God for day 33 of this prayer and fasting for days. It should make a week for us to go. By this time next week, Sunday, we are ending off. So we thank God for his grace to fast and to pray for strength, for all the testimony, for the for, for provision we have received, we we'll bless God. Be our magnified Lord Jesus tonight in the name of Jesus. Lord, let's go to the prayers tonight as we know the way we to do it. God used to give us one psalm every day. And the psalm that God gave us tonight is Psalm 85. The topic tonight is, O oh Lord, send down revival. O oh Lord, send down revival. And somebody is watching me. God will revive us again. God will send down his revival unto you in the name of Jesus. Revival will enter your house. Revival will enter your life. God will revive you again in the mighty name of Jesus. God will revive our land. Our land shall be revived. And the Christian body as a whole shall be revived again. After this pandemic, a great revival on the land is coming. So the Lord prayed, Lord spoke to me, said, He's sending down the river to people. And I pray the Lord will send his revival into your life in the mighty name of Jesus. So we are reading Psalm 85 tonight. And I love reading the Yoruba. And as I read, God bless us in Jesus' name. Oni Oluwa, Iwati Nshe, Oju Eresi, Ilere, Iwati Mu, Igbe Kunja Kobu Padabo, Iwati Dari, Iwati Dari Ashe Ede Awan, Eni Anaji, Iwati Bo, Bo e she won't let. What you move, bo boy, be no red, kuro. What you put up, kuro, no, be no, be no red. Ye walk, pada, or long like balawa, kyo simu, e be no red siwa, kyo da. You walk, oh, be no siwa, titty line, you walk, be so titty line. You walk, oh, a far, you be no red yard lati, in a dinner be. You walk, yo, to moo, was soji. You walk, yo, to moo, was soji. Kia won. Eniyanre ki o ma yore nure Oluwa fi a nure han fun wa ki o si fun wa ni igbala re emi o gbo bi Olorun Oluwa yo ti wi tori ti yo so alaafia si awon eniyan re ati si awon eyan mimo re sugbon ki won ki o ma tun pada si were nitori nitori nitoto igbala re sumo awon ti o beru re ki I want your bell, Ray. Kill go, kill ole ma, bay lewa. I know a tea or titot padera. O dodo, a tea la fiat fee, and no co, and I'm only no. O dito yo rugade, lati lewa. O dodo yo si, yo si bojuo, ila lati, or no wa. Nito talk, ulua yo funili, ito dara. Ilewa yo si ma, mu asokun rewa. O dodo. Yo sa jure, yo si fi e pase reshe onna. Ame, o goni fun baba, a ti fun oman, a ti fun yeman, bi o ti wala ti koshe, o mbe ni si sen yi, mbe ni yo si mari, inga obo, aye, a yene kwe kon. Ame, shout hallelujah. Look at that verse 6, he said, Be thou not revive us again, that thy people may rejoice in thee. 
Lord, we thou not revive us again, that your people may rejoice in thee. So, which means revival brings rejoicing, it brings happiness. Somebody is watching me tonight, God will revive you. God will send his fire of revival into your life again. You shall be revived again. Your, your, your family shall be revived again. Your ministry shall be revived again. Our nation, Nigeria, shall be revived again. And the all Christian bodies in the whole world shall be revived again after this pandemic. And the Lord will cheer up a great revival in the land in the name of Jesus. So we are going to be looking at tonight what is revival. But before we go there, we want to pray some faithful prayers as those people who have come along with this program as we all do. But number one prayer I want to pray, Lord, send down your fire of revival into my life tonight. Sinu aye mla la yoya adua ni oru koti Jesu ni oru koti Jesu la la yi olu aran ina soji re so kale wa si aye mla la yi lo send down your fire of revival in my life tonight let your fire of revival begin to rain down send down your fire of revival your rain of revival the outpouring of your revival into my life into my ministry. Revive Graceland Apostolic Fire Ministry. This is law. Let your fire of revival send descend down into a mist. This is it. Revive the old, the old Christian body's law. After this pandemic, people have sudden at all. I heard that churches will be open next week Sunday. But people have relaxed. We need revival. Law, revive your people again. Kapoli bo sontari ba kapoli. Rika tanja legebo suteria maskabo riaba. We doubt not revive us again after this pandemic. Lord, send down your fire of revival upon the land. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Rika po sidea. We are going to pray. Bogbo yang badua. E paruo. Bogbo kokoro. Toshilekun. Ire o shukejo. Oluwa kole me lawa. Kakara. To shi ilekun. I yanu. I bukun. Ena lawa. O shu kejo. Oluwa kole me lawa. Yoye adwa. Lord all the key. That open the door of blessing in this eight months. Release it into my hands now. Lord release the key. That open the door. Of blessing in this eight months unto me. Lord release the key. That open the blessing. Of this eight month to me, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, the key that opened the door of blessing in this eight month, oh Lord, release it unto me now, release it unto me now, release it unto me now. The key that opened the master key that opened the blessing of eight months, let it be released unto me. Eto mm. sakoria masadi. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Rika po sitori masadia. Le bro sitori masadia. E paruo wa ni mo pashe. Lo ruko jesu. Mo pashe. Lo ruko ti jesu kisi. Ni o shuke joyi. Onoko la fumi. Ni o shuke joyi. Bo gwede koma wamiri. I command in the name of Jesus. In this eight month, let my way be open. Let my way be open. In the name of Jesus. We are sorry, Lord, I command in the name of Jesus in this eight months. Let my way be open. Open my way. Open doors for me. In this eight month, let my doors be open. Let my way be open. In the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Eparuo. Bobo maja mutikin jaki. Ire pelo wami. Bageloni, Bobo Maja Mutikin, Jackie, your Pella Wami, Oyama Bageloni, all the covenant that does not allow me to retain blessing for a long time, to retain blessing or miracle or testimony for a long time. 
Let those covenants be destroyed tonight. Open your mouth and pray. Bobo ma je mu. Chicken jacky re o pani wa mi. Let you get my there. I can see mommy fresh I can look at you. God bless you. I can see Ellen Gis. God bless you. I got the jacket. God bless you. Tonya, Tonya. I am Tonya. Okay. God bless you, my sister. God bless you. Favor again. God bless you. And I be allowed to try. God bless you. And I am a devil like that. God bless you for watching tonight. Oluwa, Oluwa, Bobo, Maja, Muti, Kinjaki, Irepel, Lawa, Lawa, Mi, Emma, Bagla, Maja, Muti, Kinjaki, Murepel, Maja, Muti, Kinjaki, Murepel, Lawa, Bala, Yima, Bagla, Lawa, Lawa, Jesus. Recap on the story, recap producer, and lots of recap producer, story machine, Raba Sotea, Kabe Sotea. Kabori mo sitori masadia. In Jesus name we pray. Amen. Bado ayi gbabi amo. Gbugbu abi amo gbadu ayi. Gbugbu e ko rejo ko. Awon eniyan ika lati pa mi lekun ni bi ti odun iku si ko pari. Ara ati na eledu mo ma tun won ka. Ara ati na eledu mo ma tun won ka. Gbugbu e ko rejo ko. Awon eniyan ikokun lati pa mi lekun ni bi ti odun iku si ko pari. Ara ati na ele du mori. Ola ma tu waka. Every garden together of e people to make me cry in the remaining days, in the many months of this year. Let the thunder fire of God scatter them. Let the thunder fire of God scatter them. Let them be scattered by the thunder fire of God. Let them be scattered now by the thunder fire of God. Every gathering of evil people to make me cry. In the remaining days of this year, in the remaining months of this year, let the thunder fire of God scatter there. Thunder fire of God scatter, 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 scatter them, scatter them by fire, scatter them by thunder. I refuse to cry. In the remaining months of this year, I refuse to cry. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name, we pray. A paruo, but we are one tin sare je pawun lori lori mi lori ro mi e je kan pade ku gbugbu awon ni se oran tin sare je pawun tori temi oya e lo pade ku lojiji you are going to pray every evil people that has that, that has been can embark on a journey of evil to to kill me this year let them meet death on their way who is that evil errands if we are not around, get that they have sent an enemy to injure me, to, to, to attack me. Let them meet death on their way. But go and on this year, since I read the parable today, me, I'm paddling. Who not do it? Oh yeah, do it. Ni oru kanti Jesus. But go and on this year, since I read the parable today, not do it. Today I'm not doing aya. Today I'm paddling. I'm not paddling. Kula na. I'm not paddling. Kula na. Turn me on on this year parable. Every evil people running evil errands, so as to attack my life. Let them meet with death on the way. Let death catch them. Let death catch them. But go and on the shore. Things I read get panu. Told it to me. Oh yeah, hello, pade ukulana. Hello, pade ukulana. Ni oru kanti Jesus kesi. Rika ponde legre sitoria. Bobo a won this year. Tins I re ye paru. Tori te mi e pade kulo jiji. In Jesus ne we pray. Amen. E paru bo eni ya. Bobo ya badwa yi. Bobo e pade o kupon. O gan joru tori mi. A ray na o ya tu waka. Bobo e pade o kupon. O gan joru tori mi. A ray na tu waka. Every evil gathering. Every evil meeting. In the middle of the night. Because of me. Let the thunder fire of God scatter, scatter them. Let the thunder fire of God scatter them. Bo boy, padeo kuku. O gado ru tori mi arai now. Oya tuwaka, oya dua. Ni oru kati Jesus. Ni oru kati Jesus. Bo boy, padeo kuku. O gado ru fui bitori temi arai now. Oya tuwaka, arai now. Oya tuwaka. Marsika ponde legresi koria. 
Endu mo scientifique amo kwariba. Bogbo e pade okuko gandoru tori mi ara ina matuaka. Every midnight gathering for evil because of me. Let the thunder fire of God scatter them. Everyone gathering in the middle of the night because of me to, to affect me, to hinder me, to, to attack me. Let the thunder fire of God scatter them. Let them be scattered by fire. Let them be scattered by fire. Be scattered by fire in the name of Jesus. Be scattered by fire in the name of Jesus. Be scattered by fire. How do you say there? In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. A paruo. I can see God saying, Oh, what Please pray this prayer. Tosi, pray this prayer. This prayer is for you. Oh, what on shall you mean by your jaw? Oh, what on shall you mean by your juma? A jack or deck with Walaye, Luruko Jesu. Oh, what woe? Nima shall you mean by it? Neo Josh, Neo Dodo, Neo Juma, a jack give a bear or deck with Walaye. Every evil one that, that collecting my blessing before I take it. Every month, every week, every day, every year. Let those ends cease to be a living hand. Let those ends cease to be alive. Eje kiro be, kode kwe walaye. Bo gwa wo, ton sha ju mi gbare. Ni o dodon, ni o shosh, ni o sose, ni o juma. Eje kiro be. In the mighty name of Jesus. All the evil ends of the enemy. All the evil ends of the devil. That are taking my blessing before me. Be, be, before I take it. That are, take, that, that are hijacking my blessing. Hijacking my miracle. Hijacking your profit. The profit that is going to come to your hands. They hijack it. Those evil ends. Let them cease to be alive. In the name of Jesus. Kaaba Sutoria. In Jesus, name we pray, Amen. I do a thing by the name of the Lord. I do a thing by the name. Ila na matekbe ni nui na mi etori mi yipada kauli masaidia. Ila na matekbe lori ni nui na mi oluwa pada lori mi. Tori me pada every pattern of you will not meet up with your head mate. Lord, let it be changed from my head. Let it be changed from my head. Ilana mate gbere nu eran mi Oluwa tori mi pada tori mi yi pada gbogbo ilana ti alale pe awon omo eran wa oni tegbe pe a oni togba Oluwa tori mi yi pada every evil plans every evil pattern that has been laid down in my family that I will not be up to my head to my mates law on my head in my, my own tongue let it be changed let it be deleted. Let it expire. Let it be arrested tonight. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Bobo a wan lanyan le o kokota nyan ti mi. E fi kushi wan lo wan shè. La la yi. Lo le romi. Bobo a wan lanyan le o kokota nyan ti a ye mi. La la yi. E fi kushi wan lo wan shè. Lo le romi. Every evil monitoring sent out of my life. Let death stop them. Let death depart separate them from me. Fi ku pe wane ya. Tanya lanya le o kukun o bini. Tanya lanya le o kukun o kuni. Ti on tele aye mi kiri. Lale yi. Fi ku shila wa ishe. Fi ku shila wa ishe. Masi kapon de ni ku uri ya masi ada kapon ni masodi ya. Mag badwa yon kukun. E mag badwa. Lale yi. E badwa gan. Awa adwa ti mong pen. Yon fe ke e bagan. Bo gwa wa lanya le o kukun tanya ti mi. O lu wa fi ku shila wa ishe. Every evil monitoring sent out of my life. Let death separate me from death. Kill them. Use death to chase them away from me. 
gbogbo awon alayan le okukun ta yan ti mi lalayi oluwa fi ku si won lowo ise ah masika pondele ba omo be ni gbadura yi omo ko ni gbadura yi every evil monitoring sent after my life let that take hold of them let that take hold of them in the name of jesus in the name of jesus In Jesus name we pray amen in Jesus name we pray amen e padua aso osi ajogun balorun mi oya ina bodan na lei ka ori ba gbogbo aso osi ajogun balorun mi lalayi oya ina bodan every cloth of wretchedness every cloth of inherited wretchedness let fire remove it now every cloth of inherited poverty inherited penury let fire remove it now from my life, from my body. In any man, but you are a woman. Be a bad or bad sorti. I'm not a bad guy. If you not bad, but what you are doing about shit, but what you are doing about shit, now what? Are you trying to be with me? Are you trying to walk with me? Lala ye, masika pondeli andu mungu ati fikida bi orwale kedi akadamori yaba ha. Inu mosi eno tuwa fike ya denorua. Empole ya kandini inju mosua. Eto rumi kalua jana. Sidi ya kafanti jine abu. Eto miska fituna. Intu ni maruali. Ento jikapa. Kelundra sahari moskwa. Bugwa sho adoguma ushira. Lano mi fina bo. Fina bo. Let your fire remove it now. Every inherited cloth of poverty in my body, let your fire remove it tonight in the name of Jesus. Kauri mo sitoria, Kauri mo sidea. Araba ko sitori mo sinda liya gabaswad. In Jesus name we pray, Amen. Eba dua, bo we do mi adua longba ni bo ba ishenga. If you can pray, you will have victory. This is the last prayer. We are going to the word of God now. What paruo la be majemu oro to tell ori a wo mo logo ba ni nu ira mi anu fa me ja de bala leyi la be majemu oro la be majemu gbo lowo di to tell ori a wo mo logo ba nu ira mi je ki anu fa me ja de bala leyi under the covenant of negative word that I've bowed down the head of the glory shed in my family. Let your mercy bring me out of it tonight. Under the covenant of negative word that I've bowed down the head of the glory shed in my family. Let your mercy bring me out there tonight in the name of Jesus. La be maje mu odi. La be maje mu odi. To te a mo ori o mo lo go banu yami. Let ye oya anu. Gadembe, <laughs> And do more lua bakarua basiria under the covenant of negative world, under the covenant of negative world that bow down the head of the glory shy in my family. Let your mercy bring me out tonight. Let the mercy of God bring me out of that covenant tonight. I come out of the covenants in the name of Jesus. For someone who can shout the loudest, Amen. You are coming out on. You are coming out under the contrary words. Under the covenant of contrary and negative words that bow down the glory shrine of the house, the house, house, you you are coming up tonight in the name of Jesus, and the Lord will bless you. The Lord will do you good, and your glory will shine. Your glory will shine. You will not die before your time. You will not die before your time. No premature deaths. In the mighty name of Jesus. We thank God tonight for the prayer we have prayed. And I know those prayers that God gave me tonight, I've never prayed before myself. Lord God spoke to me. And I know your prayer has been answered. 
and we are going to run around for just 10 or 15 minutes, and we are still going to pray some powerful prayers. So don't, don't disconnect. Just wait till after the message. The message is a very short one. It's a very short one. The topic tonight is, Oh Lord, send down revival. Oh Lord, send down revival. Oh Lord, send down and the Lord will revive us again. I'm taking my text from that psalm that we read, Psalm 85, verse 6. Psalm 85, verse 6 there. Eh? We thou not revive us again, that thy people may rejoice in thee. We thou not revive us again, that thy people may rejoice in thee. He walk in your tumu wasoji. Ki a mwa e ninyare, ki o mayo, ki o le mayo, ninyare. So, which means, revival brings happiness, brings joy, brings rejoicing, brings laughter, brings celebration. I pray for somebody who worship me tonight. The Lord will revive you again. So that your celebration can come. And your celebration is now, in this eight months. You shall be celebrated. The Lord will celebrate you. People will gather to celebrate you. So, what is revival? Quickly, because of time. Revival is a season of every outpour or every downpour of the Spirit of God on the face of the head. Revival is a season of every outpouring or downpouring of the Spirit of God. Upon a people or a nation or a territory. So we can say the book of Joel, chapter 2, verse 28. Joel, chapter 2, verse 28 says, On that day will I pour my spirit unto the all flesh. Say, so Your sons shall prophesy, and your daughters shall prophesy, and your old men, old women shall dream dreams. He said, I will pour out my spirit upon the old man. May the Lord pour out his spirit. May the Lord pour out his river. The rain of river. May he be poured upon you today in the name of Jesus. The rain of river that will bring celebration into your domain, into your house, into your territory. May Jehovah God in the name of Jesus. So it is a season of Intense outpouring of the spirit. The time of revival, it is a season of intense outpouring of Holy Spirit, of the Spirit of God. So revival is a season of the breaking forth of the glory of God upon the head or upon people. So revival is a season of the breaking forth of the glory of God upon people or upon Upon, upon you as an individual. So you are in a season of revival. And the Lord will break forth his glory. The glory of God shall break forth upon you. Oh go along your father no ayere. Oh go along my sokka yalori. Wari o go to oriri. O go tin ta tiki in tan. Onu ma yodai fumo. O go to my wano ayere. So a time of revival. It's a time of breaking forth in glory. And somebody is watching me from any part of the world. You are watching me from tonight. You are breaking forth in revival. You are breaking forth in glory. In this season, in this month, before the end of this year, you shall break forth in new glory in the name of Jesus. In the book of 2 Chronicles, chapter 5, verse 13 to 14. 2 Chronicles, chapter 5, verse 13 to 14. He says, when the people have sung, I said, the, and the, the old house where Solomon was, the temple that Solomon built was filled with the smoke. It means the presence of God. He said, and the glory of God came down. The cloud came down to the extent that the, the, the priests could not carry out their assignment because the glory of God had descended. That's a revival. That is a revival. That is when the glory come down, when the spirit come down, when the presence of God come down, that is a time, a season of revival. And it comes for the purpose. Revival can be a personal revival. A personal revival can happen. A territorial revival can happen. Revival can happen in a territory. 
If I ever can, it can be a national revival. In the, uh, in the America, we, we know Asusa, Asusa Street Revival. The whole street was changed. The whole street was revived. I pray that the revival, the fire of revival, the rain of revival shall rain down upon Nigeria, upon the whole church in Nigeria, even after this pandemic. And the churches of Nigeria will never, shall never remain the same again in the name of Jesus. The revival, the fire of revival, the on you will follow your family and you as individual and you will never remain the same anymore in the name of jesus in the name of jesus so tonight quickly before i end up what happens when god sends personal revival i'm constraining individual revival tonight what happened when god sent personal revival let's look at the book let's look at an example of somebody that god sent a personal revival into his life. The man is Isaiah, the prophet Isaiah. The Lord encountered him. The Lord sent a personal revival unto him. He encountered God. Let's look at the book of Isaiah, chapter 6. Isaiah, chapter 6, verse 1 to 8 or 10. Isaiah, chapter 6, verse 1 to 8. Quickly, let me read it. It says, In the year that King Uzziah died, I saw also the Lord sitting upon the throne. I am lifted up and his strength filled the temple. Above, above he stood the seraphim. Each one had six wings. With twin, he covered his face. And with twin, he covered his feet. And with twin, he did fly. And one cried unto one another and said, Holy, holy, holy is the Lord of hosts. The whole earth is full of his glory. And the post of the door moved. At the voice of him that cried, and the house was filled with the smoke. Then said I, Woe is me, for I am undone, because I am a man of unclean lips, and, and I dwell in the midst of a people of unclean lips. For my eyes have seen the, see the king and the Lord of hosts. Then flew one of the seraphim unto me, having a live coal in his hand, and he had taken with the tongues from off the altar. And he laid it upon my mouth and said, Lo, this I touched thy lips, and thy iniquity is taken away, and thy sin is purged. Also I heard the voice of the Lord saying, Who shall I send, and who will go for us? Then said I, Here I am, send me. And he said, Go, and tell these people, Hear ye indeed, but understood not, and see ye indeed, but perceive not. Hallelujah. You can see how God encounter Isaiah in chapter 6 of, Isaiah, of the book of Isaiah. Isaiah was a prophet of God, a major prophet in the Bible. And he has been prophesying all things. So tell you, chapter 6 of it. All those so tell you, chapter 6 of it. I yield to you. Somebody can be, be a man of God, a prophet, a geo. And he has never met with heaven. He has never encountered God. He has never visited Gogota. So somebody can be not a miracle. Somebody can be can be a good giver in the church and never had an encounter. Somebody can build a house, a church for God, and never had an encounter. A life, a, 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 a Isaiah here. He was a major prophet. He has been prophesying. But until the day that King Uzziah died, every Uzziah that has never allowed you to see God or to see the hand of God upon your life or to allow the glory of God to fall upon you, that King Uzziah shall die today. Your own Uzziah shall die tonight. Every Uzziah that has covered your vision, that cover your dreams, that cover your vision, shall die tonight in the name of Jesus. Bible said the day that King Uzziah died, as I said, I saw the Lord. He saw the Lord. He had a personal encounter with God. He had a definite revelation with God. He could be able to describe what he saw. You are going to see God. And you will not be able to deny that you see him. And people that meet you will know that you have had a definite encounter with God. Somebody is watching me from anywhere you are watching me from tonight. You will have an encounter with God tonight that you will never recover from till the rest of your life. In the name of Jesus. So quickly, 
What are the five things? What are the five things that happen when God send a personal revival into you? To you, the five things that happen when God send you a personal revival. When God revive you, say without revival, without no revivals again, that we may rejoice in thee. So five things that happen when God send you a personal revival, like Isaiah. Number one thing that happen, it brings personal revelation. It will bring personal revelation. You will have a personal revelation of God. Miracle magician He will leave his church and go to another place. We are there because he has never had a revelation of whom God is. The day you have a revelation of God, that is the day you are free. That is the day no prophet, no pastor, no evangelist will be able to, dece to, to deceive you anymore because you will know your God personally. So, a revival said brings about personal revelation. You will have a personal revelation about God and God will reveal himself to you. And I pray for somebody tonight, God will reveal himself to you in your dream, as you are, as you are praying, as you are fasting, you will see God and you will know God personally. Number two things that it will bring. It brings about personal encounter with God. You will have washi abapa de pelolonu. You will have a personal encounter with God. And nobody have an encounter that their life will never change. Jacob had an encounter. Bible says he was left alone in that night. And a man was fighting, wrestling with him. And the man could not prevail, he prevailed. And since that day, his name was changed. And that was encounter, his life changed. The encounter that will bring transformation to your life and destiny tonight, receive it in the name of Jesus. May you receive that encounter. That will bring about a change of name into your life. That will bring revival into your family. That will cause everything to change drastically in your life. Receive it now. Moses had an encounter with God. He saw a bush burning and the bush was not burnt. He said, let me look aside and Lord called him. He said, Moses, you are, you are, you, you, you are there in the flock. But I want to give you a, 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 an assignment, a task. And since that day, the life of Moses was transformed. Anytime you have a personal encounter with God, it brings about transformation and celebration. That is why it is brings about revival. I pray for a personal encounter tonight that you will have an encounter with God. A encounter that will bring about personal transformation. Receive it tonight in the name of Jesus. Number three things that personal revival brings is that it exposes your personal errors and comes to you. It exposes, it will expose when God commits with you. Nobody will tell you you are a sinner. You will begin to confess yourself. You can look at Isaiah. He said, I'm a man of a clean lips. Nigba told you alone. Oh dear, Elisha Nimi will lead to things so. To so near. Oh no, so tell that chapter one. That chapter five. Oh, also, and nothing more fun. So tell that no, she no have money. So when God have you have a personal error with God, it will expose your personal errors and shortcomings to you. Only a lie, my enemy. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a sinner. I'm a man of unclean lips. It's a woe unto me. I'm a sinner. Only a benefit of the way. So he saw himself without nobody telling him. So when you have an encounter with God, you will see yourself without, without any preacher preach to you. You will see your errors. You will see your weaknesses. You will see your mistake. We are you have made you are, you have you have taken the wrong steps, you will see it and you'll be able to adjust yourself. I pray, may God reveal your mistake to you tonight. May God reveal your errors to you tonight. We are you have been doing it wrong. May God reveal yourself to you. May God reveal you to you in the name of Jesus. Lord, reveal me to me. Reveal me to me. Let me know myself. And that's Number four. Number four. It brings about cleansing and purging. In that verse seven, he said, One angel took a life coal from fire and touched the tongue of Isaiah. He said, Today, your sin is purged. 
your sin is forgiven, your error is deleted, and it will bring about purging and cleansing. When you have a personal revival with God, God will cleanse you from your error. God will purge you from all your mistakes, and you will not be able to do it anymore. I pray for somebody tonight watching me. May God cleanse you. May God purge you. May you be purged. May you be totally cleansed. May the blood of Jesus wash you clean tonight from all errors of the past, from your past, from the errors of yesterday, from the mistake you have made in your past. May those errors be deleted in the name of Jesus. I said, for emphasis sake, I said five things that personal revival brings to you or apples. Number one, it brings personal revelation. Number two, it will bring about personal encounter with God. Number three, it exposes your personal errors and shortcomings to you. Number four, it brings about cleansing and purging. Number five, it brings destiny redirection. It will bring destiny redirection. You can see that verse it says, it says, and I heard a voice. We said, whom shall I send and who shall mm -hmm. go for us? He said, here I am, send me. So his destiny was redirected to the purpose of God. So God send him on, 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 on an errand. I pray, may God redirect your destiny to the original place. <laughs> you may be here God will direct your destiny now into your original uh, original place in that name. So what what are the things that brings revival? Quickly, what brings revival? What brings revival? Just two minutes. Passionate hunger and desire for God brings revival. You must hunger for it and desire to, to know God. 62 verse 1, 73 Verse 1 or 2. Psalm 63, verse 1 or 2. He said, I, In a lowly and artistic land, I, I desire you. Number two thing that brings revival is intense, earnest prayer. Intense, earnest prayer. Zechariah 10 1. He said, pray, He said, I will send rain unto you when you call upon me. When you call upon me, I will send rain of river upon you. Number three, you must be ready to pray. To pay. You must be ready to pay the. To pay the price. So anything that has a value attracts a cost. For every rise, there is a price to pay to rise. Philippians 3, 12 to 14. Philippians 3, 12 to 14. I run towards the goal so that I can win the price of the high calling of God. So anything that has a value attracts a cost. I will be ready to pay the price so as to gain the price. I pray for you tonight. May God give you strength. To gain the price in the name of Jesus. So quickly, we are going to, to, to the prayer. I'm going to pray. Oh Lord, tonight, create an is create an hunger in me to always want you. Create an hunger for God, hunger to fast, to pray, unsatisfied hunger, insatiable hunger for God. Create it in me. Open your mouth and pray. Oluwa. Da o be ti ko le tan La te ma wa u jure si no me O be ti ma fi ma O be alon Ti ma fi ma wa u jure no me bo iba O be ti ko le tan Ti o ma me ki ma wa u jure La la yi da si no me In Jesus name We pray In Jesus name we pray Pray Spiritual powerlessness Die tonight Every spiritual powerlessness In my life Die tonight. Open your mouth and pray. My father, my father, I pray every spiritual powerlessness die tonight. Let every spiritual powerlessness die tonight. Every spiritual powerlessness. I command you to die tonight in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Pray. Any power assigned to destroy my destiny, die. Any power assigned to destroy my destiny, I command you to die. I command you to die. Open your mouth and pray. My father, my father. Any power assigned to destroy my destiny. Tonight, I command you. Die. 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 
that any power assigned to destroy my destiny, I command you tonight to die in the mighty name of Jesus. You are going to pray. I shall have unstoppable advancement. I shall have unstoppable advancement. You are going to pray. Oh Lord, give me unstoppable advancement. Open your mouth and pray. Oluwa fumini, i bega ti akin daduro, i bega mag do she daduro, i bega ti ane keni kole di lawo, ti ak kole daduro. Yon die fumi, yon die, 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 yon die. Unstoppable advancement. Give it to me tonight. Let me have unstoppable advancement in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I'm going to pray. I recover tenfold all my wasted years. I recover tenfold all my wasted years. Let me recover it tenfold all my wasted years. All the years that I've wasted. Lord, tenfold. Let me recover it now. I recover tenfold all my wasted years. Open your mouth and pray. My father, my father, Lord, I recover tenfold all my wasted years in the name of Jesus. I recover tenfold all my wasted years. Lord, all the years I've wasted, recover it for me. I recover tenfold. Misaini kindu molu basaida. Litro sakali and gini eru mo safiti agenu mo swake pindi ni heri aliambo. I recover tenfold all my wasted years. Ni shakpo me wa olwa da pada fumi. Bo gwa koko timoti fi shofu. O jo ori bila fi shofu. Bo gwa koko mi tayo ti fi shofu. Da pada fumi. Li lopo lopo. I lopo lopo. Fi o rena da pada. Fi bukun da pada. Bo gwa koko timoti fi shofu. I bukun la. O rena la. O lwa fi da pada. Recover for me tonight. In ten fold. In million fold. In thousands fold. All my wasted years. Rimo sagre limo sonta ye grosu pari abaska. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Hey, Badua. Any shame binding my finances, break now by fire. Any shame binding my finances, break now. Let it break. Let any shame of the devil, any shame of the devil that's bound my finances. Tony, look boy, the chio today eto show me ema galalei. Look boy, any idiota, idio kuku. Today eto show me galalei oya maja. I de malola wa, I de malishe, I de aine. You told them me, told them to show me. Allah ya maja. Every shame that is binding my finances, I command you to die. I break you by fire. Break, 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 break tonight. Break by fire. Break by fire. Break by fire tonight. Let every shame that bind my finances be broken by fire. Be broken by fire. In the name of Jesus, Ruta so pari gadoba, ile mosukra badu yetu aneswa, and to kopolia. Agbadua, bogo agbara boji, togbe ogwaye mimi. Agbara aji de bafu pada, bogo agbara boji, totigbe ogo mimi. Agbara aji de o, oya bafu pada. Every power of the grave that swallow my glory, let the power of resurrection collect it back for me. The power of resurrection that brought Jesus out of the grave on the third day. Let that power restore back my glory that has been buried in the burial ground, in the grave. Every power of the grave that swallow my glory. Power of resurrection. Restore it back to me. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Pray the last prayer. Everybody pray the last prayer. Agbara o kuku tonti o jua la ba irela wami ida ikuko ba kaoleba. Bogo agbara o kuku. E yito man ti o jua la ba irela wami. Ala yi ida ikuko ba every power of darkness that do collect my blessing from the dream in my hands. Let the sword of death strike him dead. Let the stroke, sword of death strike him dead. Let that power be strike dead. Bagbara boji, bagbara okuku. Tomantio dua la bailo ami ida iku olwa 
Ojo ba idaiku ko je ola la in the name of Jesus. In Jesus name we pray. Amen. We thank God for tonight for the way that God has blessed us tonight and we pray prayer has been answered in the name of Jesus. Ah uh, tomorrow Oh, tomorrow, one of the invited guests will be on here. Prophet Ekunjesu, please, I beg you, don't miss it tomorrow. Tomorrow is going to be powerful. It is going to be wonderful. He's an apostle. He's a prophet. He's going to be talking prophetically and pray with us. He's coming up on here tomorrow. He's the one minister tomorrow. Pastor Ekunjesu JP. And I pray that God will bless you through his ministry tomorrow in the name of Jesus. So I announce to you, everybody watching me, tomorrow by 5 p.m., don't miss it, Pastor Prophet Ekunjesu JP from Ekon Christian Center will be ministry tomorrow. It's going to be powerful. Invite your friends, your neighbor to attend tomorrow's program. Just connect with us on air tomorrow by 5 p.m. And God bless you through his ministration. You will enjoy God through his anointing. In the name of Jesus. Bring out your water and let's pray for your water. Lord, this is my water. Let your blood cover my water. Release your blood over my water. Let it touch your blood. I will bless you. 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 I Wise Latori, the address, Koma Jade, Bobwise, Naguara, Nino Mara, Ninwedo, Koma Jade, Nuru, yes, Mommy, King Bess, Bara, Jesus, never pray. Let's pray. Oh, call us. Lord, we thank you tonight for the prayer of prayer for the men. Oh, we are saying that you see your letters. May God celebrate and rejoice in you. We pray. Everyone that watches us, live your mind, your dream, in your vision, in the name of Jesus. God will send this real power onto your life, into your life, in the name of Jesus. I pray that all the people pray, heaven will answer it speedily, in the name of Jesus. I turn this water to the blood of Jesus. As you drink it, all the source, all the sickness in your body, it will go out with urine and feces, in the name of Jesus. I command that sickness in your life to die. I command that sickness in your body to be over. You are here. From your head to the toe of your feet, you are here in the name of Jesus. Bible says they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of their testimony. I did not fear their life even to the point of death. I pray by the blood of Jesus that have mixed with this water, as you drink it, you overcome. You have victory over your enemies in the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Father, for answer prayers. In Jesus' name. We pray. Amen. Thank God for tonight. Let's share the grace together. May the grace of Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Shout say hallelujah. 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 God bless you. See you tomorrow. Prophet Adia Kunjesu is coming tomorrow. Don't miss it. Invite your neighbor to watch with you. And try and share that video with many groups with your friend. God bless you. Love you all with love of God.